Uh, good evening. Uh, welcome to Season A, where the platform where we speak to you about breaking news. Breaking news. Uh, Tinobu has suspended Emefiele with immediate effect. He suspends Emefiele with immediate effect. With immediate effect. So let's go through what he said briefly to get an idea. Here goes. So by Channel's news. Sorry about that. President Bola Tinobu suspends Central Governor, Central Bank Governor, Mr. Godwin Emefiele from office with immediate effect. The Director of Information Office of the Secretary to the Government of Federation, Willy Bassi, said in a Friday statement, this is a sequel to the ongoing investigation of his office and planned reforms in the financial sector of the economy. Mr. Emefiele has been directed to immediately hand over the affairs of his office to the Deputy Governor of Operations uh, Directorate, Fola Shodun, Adebisi Shonubi. And for Lashodun, ADBC shouldn't be who will act as the central bank governor pending the conclusion of the investigations and the reforms. This development is coming less than two weeks after the pres after President Tinobu's assumed office and two months after the CBN's heavily criticized Nara swap. So uh that's uh, so that's what's going on. Uh let me just quickly do something with it, that one. I want to make sure we are so we're reading that. I'm trying to hide some advertisements because I don't want them to show up in the broadcast. So I do want to give anybody free advert at all on this platform um, because I want to make sure that from here on uh, we do things the way we want to do it. So here we go. So sorry about that. So uh -huh. former president, let me just make that up. I don't want that up there either. So you see that now. Let me just so former president, sorry. Former President Mohamed Bora's government introduced a new banknote late last year, arguing it would help tackle vote buying, insecurity, and fight inflation, among other things. But weeks before the polls, the country was hit by, with a cash crunch as the CBN withdrew the old notes. The development drew criticisms from criticisms from top personalities. Some of the state governors even took the matter to court with Tinubu's 14, with Tinubu 14 the implementation of the policy. As, the, as then presidential candidate of the ruling APC or Progressive Congress APC, Tinubu asked CBN to allow both old and new notes to coexist. So here we go. So just give me a minute. I'm just going to be giving you that back again. I don't want to give you any, <coughs> not going to give me free advice to anybody. So, <coughs> so here we go again. <coughs> so we're going to go here. So Tinubu said he was only concerned about the disruptive implementation and the hardship it has brought on the generality of our people who currently can't access their hard-earned money to meet obligations and the attendant consequences of informal sector where majority operate. <coughs> In the lead-up to the presidential elections, his campaign team claimed the move was targeted at Tinubu. During his inauguration, President Tinubu did not mince words about the Naira swap policy, promised to review it. He maintained that it was too harsh, harshly applied by the CBN and given the number of unbanked Nigerians. So, um, I, I guess you could say that has been in the, in the, in the what shall we say. The policy shall be reviewed in the meantime. My administration will treat both currencies as legal tender. So, um, just as a final thing there, let me just quickly, I don't want these other things to be showing. That's why I'm really being careful. So, so you see here, the policy will be reviewed. Uh, in the meantime, my administration will treat both currencies as legal tender. Uh, this was carried by, by covered by channels, and we're bringing it on to you here, so you can have that information fresh off the press, as it were. Um, I hope you find it inf informative. Uh, what do you think about it? Uh, that looks like a decisive move. Um, whatever you think about Tinubu, uh, I'm still, you know, I, I believe in Yoruba Nation, but whatever you think about him, that seems like a decisive move to me. Uh, seems good, and let's see what happens. Let's see. Uh, it's, it's it sounds interesting sounds promising so let's see what you know what happens what what, what progresses what are your thoughts you're watching citizen ay the platform where we speak truth to power uh, please share the broadcast let us know what you think uh, what do you think of the song that you're hearing about how long will they cover uh, when i go when i go to so far how long it's a song i wrote uh, let, leave comments about the song it's called how long how long will i go to so far so you're hearing the chorus line there. You, the whole song, you can download it on the do a Citizen AY on YouTube or go to Spotify and iTunes and download it as well. That can help us on the platform. We appre really appreciate your, your support. Um, what do you think about Tino Bo suspending Amy Uh Do you think it's a good move? Do you think it's timely? Let's leave your comments. Let's hear from you. You're watching Citizen AY, the platform where we speak truth about the Thank you. Bye for now.